that we take the good from it and we move on. And one little thing I would suggest that I find helpful is do not hold any bitterness or any negative feelings towards a company. Because sometimes we do that. And I find that negative feelings cause heartache and problem and sickness and stress. It provided a job for as long as it did and for that we should be thankful. It cannot continue but it is a golden opportunity for us to reach out and do something else. We have talent within us and you don't want to go back to your grave with the talent that you have. Sometimes like Muhammad Ali, you just need somebody to bring out the greatness inside of you. What if he had not stood up? Interesting, eh? Okay. So that's the G. And the A is acceptance. Acceptance. Sometimes we have to just embrace acceptance. Life is just what it is. There's a saying, boy, I saw you go. I saw you go. We can't go back and change it. So accepting what is is a way of letting go. I find that people who refuse to let go, if it's even a relationship, if you man says she's done, other man says done, you're done. Let go and you let go of the pain. People who refuse to let go, hold on to the pain. So I think when life throws us a curveball, throws us some lime or some lemons, is what we do with it. Is what we do with it. You can come out of this stronger, better, financially more stable. But first, you have to just accept what is happening. You didn't create it. Now, how do you respond to something that was not of your making? It was unwanted. It's not something. And whether it is sudden or it was in the making, because we have had several rounds of this. This is not new. It is always unwelcome, just like the other things that I mentioned. They are unwelcome. Death, divorce, sickness, unwelcome. But it's how we deal with it. And I think acceptance is a big part of it. And the last point is know your rights. Know your rights. What are you entitled to? Make sure it is clear. Sit down and get a proper explanation if you have questions. Make sure you have the information for the people in personnel if you need to follow. Those who worked permanently, make sure you collect your P45 form because you're going to need that if you have another job. So know your rights, know what you're entitled to, have everything documented. And there's always a right of appeal. If you're not happy with something, we have a country that respects labor, and that is important. So if you feel that something is not altogether right, you have the opportunity to redress. And move right along. The next job, probably it's not the next job, maybe it's your business. Starting your own business. The funds that you're going to collect, I say, be careful with it. When you get it, before you do anything, put it away carefully and make sure you get good advice. So, simple, but simple doesn't mean easy. Life can be sweeter and much sweeter after sugar, but it's really up to you and the attitude.